Hello from Can Lions. This is the last day here in La Croisette. It's been an exhausting week, but a very interesting one, and we we're very happy to be all together here in France back again, despite the weather hasn't been great. Um, I want to share with you like five points uh, of the week, and this is my personal vision. Uh, first of all, this is of course the festival of creativity, but more and more we see tech companies. So surprisingly, uh, Amazon had an amazing beach at the port, and of course the Googles, the Metas, the Snapchats. Uh, were here also and it's important to see how they are near to creativity and how they're getting close. Second point is uh, holding companies have had a large presence, lots of events in their beaches, but they're not alone. So we're seeing other big groups growing. So Stackwell Group, for example, and the Brand Watch also have been growing immensely in the festival and with interesting content. Um, in order to see the two areas of growth that we've seen clearly, the first of all is pharma, uh, wellness and health. It's growing heavily. We believe there is a rise of creativity in this type of brands. You should focus on it. It's important income, especially in the US market, but also in other markets. And more and more, uh, pharma or wellness is not only the chemicals of the industry of laboratories, it's more about um, other industries and they're able to do amazing pieces of work that change lives of, of people. For example, go and see the campaign of Honduras, Morning Island, which I think is an excellent piece that managed to change the law in a country of, like Honduras. B2B is growing heavily. We had a very interesting seminar of LinkedIn, which of course leads the B2B market and how the brands are growing at this one's that are the software companies and the technology companies. And of course, there are big budgets and they need creativity to really uh, make the creative promise making, which in, in advertising is very common. Um, creativity for diversity. Um, sometimes in the festival, everybody complained about this big idea, social or environmental, that were little actions. I think this year we've seen a huge change. So we see big ideas from big top companies that are going to help the world change. So for example, the Nike app, or when women are doing sports and they have their menstruation, I think it's a relevant uh, touch to the community. Many banking really trying in, in, especially in Latin American markets, to change the way financials are addressed to women and how they really can access credit uh, to develop their lives. And also the real time campaign, which is um, an interesting one, go to see it, is like how iPhone is going to change uh, your camera in order to um, take pictures and video of black people and being really in, a good, in, in as good quality as for Caucasians are. So um, I think this idea of uh, social, environmental and equality diversity campaigns, it's really um, uh, in its peak point and brands are really looking at it. And on the last point, I wanted to talk about collaboration. If you see the titles, there has always been lots of agencies on there, but now we can see it's the combination of creative agency, platforms, data companies, consulting companies, and developers and production companies, all together are the ones that are able to do the best ideas. So please do not forget, I think we are in an age of collaboration, and this is more important now than ever. And as a last point, I don't want to forget Ukraine. It's been on the agenda. Of uh, President Zelensky was on stage and we have an incredible power in this industry to keep fighting for this war and keep helping the Ukrainian people. So thank you very much. This has been an excellent year and goodbye from Can Lions 2022. See you next year. Thank you.